Hello, how to solve for s and y in this system of equation s plus y is equal to 6, s y is equal to 6. Then from here, s plus y is equal to 6. Let's call this equation 1. And then s y is equal to 6. Let's call this equation 2. From equation 2, from equation 1, Let's make y the subject of the formula. y is equal to 6 minus x. Then this is equation 3. Also from equation 2, s y is equal to 6. We want to substitute for y. Then we have x, y equal to 6. s bracket y is 6 minus s is equal to 6. Let's open the bracket. s times 6. This is 6 x minus s times s. s square is equal to 6. And this is 6 x minus s square minus c is, is equal to zero then let's multiply both sides by minus one then multiply by minus one here will be minus six s plus s square plus c is equal to zero we can rearrange this s square minus 6x plus 6 equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. From quadratic general formula, s equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then from this equation, a equal to 1, b equal to minus 6, c equal to 6. Then let's substitute s is equal to minus bracket minus 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 6 over 2 multiply by 1. S is equal to minus times minus 6. That is 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square. That is 36 minus 4 multiply by 1 multiply by 6. That is minus 24 over 2 multiply by 1. 2 s is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 minus 24 that is 12 over 2 s is equal to 6 plus or minus 12 can be written as 4 multiply by 3 over 2. S is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 4 is 2. Then root 3. Everything over 2. S is equal to this is 6 over 2 plus or minus 2 over 2 root 3. This will cancel this 2 year 1, 2 year 3. S is equal to 3 plus or minus square root of 3. 
therefore x1 is equal to 3 plus square root of 3 or s2 equal to 3 minus square root of 3 these are the value of x then we can solve for y using equation 3 from equation 3 that is y is equal to 6 minus x then when s is equal to 3 plus root 3 you see y1 will be equal to 6 minus x1 y1 is equal to 6 minus bracket 3 plus root 3 y1 is equal to 6 minus 3 minus times plus that minus root 3 y1 is equal to 3 minus root 3 also for y2 y2 is equal to 6 minus s2 then y2 is equal to 6 minus bracket 3 minus root 3 y2 is equal to 6 minus 3 plus root 3 y2 is equal to 3 plus root 3 then from here s1 comma y1 is equal to s1 is 3 plus root 3 comma y1 is 3 minus root 3 also s2 comma y2 is equal to 3 minus root 3 comma 3 plus root 3 so these are the final answer we can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong let's check to check we want to check using either equation 1 or 2 then from 1 s plus y equal to 6 then when s is 3 plus root 3 and y is equal to 3 minus root 3 let's see we have 3 plus root 3 plus 3 minus root 3 must be equal to 6 then this will cancel this we have 3 plus 3 must be equal to 6 3 plus 3 this is 6 is equal to 6 which is true also let's consider equation 2 from 2 x y equal to 6 let's do the same thing we have 3 plus root 3 multiplied by 3 minus root 3 must be equal to 6 let's see 3 times 3 this is 9 3 times minus root 3 that is minus 3 root 3 3 then root 3 times 3 that is plus 3 root 3 root 3 times minus root 3 this is minus square root of 9 must be equal to 6 then this is 
9 this one will cancel this minus root 9 this is 3 must be equal to 6 9 minus 3 this is 6 equal to 6 which is also true you may also use y2 and s2 i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel bye bye